Missile tests were conducted at Pingdong's Zhou Pong and Taidong's Chenggong bases Thursday by the developer of the missiles, the National Zhongshan Institute of Science and Technology. The unlimited altitude tests have given rise to reports that the institute could have been testing Xiongshan cruise missile systems. A media commentator says that that was indeed the case. Let's hear from him. The tests were initially going to start on August the 8th on Father's Day and go on for a month. But on August 4th, China carried out its own missile tests and exercises, with more than 100 aircraft and more than 10 military vessels crossing the median line on the Taiwan Strait. So in order not to raise tensions further, it was decided that the missile test would be postponed to yesterday. The surface-to-surface -surface Xiongsheng missile has doubled the range of the Skybo-3. It can reach Beijing. This round of tests will feature the Xiongsheng. In related news, Taiwan's military has released a new video showing Taiwan's armed forces responding to China's drills near Taiwan earlier this month. The images show the close proximity between Taiwan's military vessels and the POAs Anyang and Xuchang frigates. Earlier this week, President Tsai Ing-wen visited Taiwan's Naval Fleet Command to thank soldiers for their hard work in keeping Taiwan safe at a time of heightened cross-strait tensions.